good everybody and welcome to another try on haul y'all already know what it is y'all know just gonna put it on and i'm gonna give you guys some fashion inspos throughout this video um we're gonna go ahead and rate i'll give you guys real life reviews and i'm also going to um, put all the links below in the description for you guys. So if you guys didn't see my first unpackaging video, I was actually unpackaging everything for you guys and telling you guys like how much I um how much everything was and totaled up to. Um, so go ahead and check that video out if you guys would like to see more of how much was spent. Um, but in this in this video, I will just be giving you guys the links to everything. So let's have some fun. And you know, I like me some clothes. Okay, here we go. So we're gonna start with outfit number one. So let's turn up. Outfit number one. Yes, I hope you guys are feeling it. I definitely really like the vibes. I really love the shades. I love how like the yellow is actually making like the rest of the outfit pop. Like I said in the previous and the other video when I was unpackaging everything, I wanted to buy red shades, but they kind of sold out. So I was like, the yellow is kind of, kind of was like the next best thing. So I really feel like the yellow actually is better because it makes it pop. It's giving like the primary color vibe. Um, but yeah, so head to toe shades. You know what I'm saying? I love how big that they look. I really, really love the shades. They're very comfortable, not too big for my, they don't fit like they're too big for my face. And then we got the crop top shirt. Um, The crop top shirt, I love how it's like cut off here. It kind of was a little bit big, even though this is a size small, but I did go ahead and tie the front with the scrunchie and I kind of like opened it up a little bit just, that, just so that you guys can see a little bit of what's going on up here. So, this is what the back looks like. And then I love the pants. I got these, I think in an extra small or small, I'm not too sure because I think they were saying they're super stretchy and I didn't want it to be too baggy on me because I feel like pants like this, they're supposed to be fit snug. I don't really like how long they are. Like look, <laughs> look how long they are. But you know, just bring it down a little bit and it kind of, I feel like it kind of holds itself in place. I'm kind of, you, it kind of gives room for you to tuck that stomach in. And I'm kind of bloated, so don't touch. And then we got the Rick Owen Dukes on, and I just put some high socks. Um, and yeah, this is the outfit. I think I would probably pair this with, pro I don't know what kind of bag really. Did I even buy a bag for this? The shoes are super, super comfortable. Um, and I love how they're low top. I thought they were gonna look a little bit big, but now looking at it, the shoes actually look cute. Yeah. So I'm definitely feeling this. I would give this outfit for sure a, I'd probably give it a 10 because it is so good. Okay, next outfit. So it's giving a, something a little bit more, it's casual, but still kind of like, if I wanted to pop out to like the champagne bar or the champagne room, I could with a little bit of style. Um, the pants are definitely um, what kind of sets the outfit off. Um, so we're gonna start with the shirt. I love the crop top shirt, it's a tube top. Um, and I love like the hands on it. I love the hands on it and then the bag I kind of just threw the bag on this is actually not for this outfit essentially but I thought it would be cute because I have the shoes on these shoes aren't for this outfit but I threw it on just to have something um but I love the pants I wish that they were a little tighter even though this says it's a small or extra small they don't necessarily feel like that they kind of feel like a medium um I really thought the pants on the bottom was gonna be a little bit more big to kind of go over the shoes. So you wouldn't see like the back of the shoes cause you could see the back. And I don't think I really like that. But if, <clears throat> but if they were a little bit more wider on the bottom, it would be perfect. Um, I'm kind of bloated right now. 
So I don't feel like my stomach is as flat as I want it to be, but it is what it is. Um, but the pants are very comfortable. They're kind of see-through. Like I said, I thought the pants were gonna be a little bit more tighter. And even though I like my pants high-waisted, these go all the way up here. Come on, oh well. I don't know. Maybe it'll look cuter if you put it up here. You don't really have to do too much with this outfit. Just put like a cute necklace on. Like I have probably some cute stud earrings, um, a cute little bag, and you set it off. But I'm gonna give you guys the whole 360. If I were to rate this outfit, I would definitely say, I'd probably give this outfit, maybe like the way I feel today is kind of throwing it off, but I'd probably give this outfit like a seven and a half. Very comfortable, the tube top is comfortable, the pants are comfortable. I could twerk in it if I wanted to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so yes, this is outfit number two. Tell me what you guys think. Getting more so like I don't know like summer warm spring vibes with the vibrant orange we're gonna start with the crochet hat yes it is crochet it is super cute and warm it kind of looks weird on my head right now because of course my hair is in the bun but it's super cute I love like the vibrant colors so I'm loving loving the hat and the um, it's just a simple white beater shirt I love how the shirt is super stretchy um, it's very good quality and very thick as well. Um, this is what the back looks like. And then I'm loving like the crochet like pants and the little flares at the bottom and the top of it. It's giving very much playful, cute. And then the bag. The bag is like the same material. It feels like the shirt really. Um, but I kind of threw in like the orange. So this is something that if you were walking, you know, down the beach with, you know, walk into the sand, put your feet in the sand. I don't have any shoes right now on, and that's why I'm not showing y'all my feet. Um, but this could be paired with like some sandals or maybe even some low top um, cute sneakers without strings or something like that, some vans. Um, maybe something simple, because this is giving simple, but still like comfortable and still cute, like still presentable. So. Yeah, this is outfit number three. If I were to rate this, I would say, I'd probably give this a good seven, a good seven. But I like also how I got my booty cheek a little out. And then the pants have like um, underwear in them. So if I wanted to not wear underwear, I'd be set, I'd be good, I'd be all set. button-down shirt. I love how I could just, Woo! I'm not wearing no bra right now, but I would have to wear a bra because I want my titties to sit up a little bit. But y'all, with the open chest a little bit, the pants feel super nice. Like, y'all know me, I love leather. The back looking nice, no back fat showing. Oh, just this ass fat showing. Yeah, I'm giving this outfit, okay, we gonna get into the outfit then I'll rate it. So I really do feel like this outfit really fits the style of my hair, the sleek ponytail, because it gets to show everything. It gets to show everything, okay? Um, I think I got this outfit in an extra small. Hugging the body the way that it's supposed to hug it. The leather crop top and the pants are very stretchy. It gives a little bit of that stretch. I really thought I was gonna fit in these because they were, they look tiny, but I got to, you know, fit my little self into this, you know what I'm saying? And then I paired it off with the Rick Owen dupes. 
Um, I essentially bought the dupes for this outfit. So it was originally for this outfit. So did I do it? Did I do did I do this outfit? Did I? I love it. So this is something that you would I, I feel like if I were to pair it with like some heels, like with these boots per se, I could wear it, I could wear it out like in a nice environment. But if I also wanted to do like something casual but still cute, I could pair it with some sneakers. You know what I'm saying? Boots, sneakers. Or I could even do some open toe heels, show my pretty little toes. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, pair this off with like some sexy glasses. Or maybe not, show this pretty face. You know what I'm saying? Cause this outfit is fire. I would rate this outfit a 10 out of 10. This is my favorite outfit by far. But yeah, if I paired it with heels, the booty would have been toothing a little bit more. This look cute. It's giving like kind of sophisticated, but then when you turn around, it's like, boom, like in your face. Like. <laughs> so yeah, definitely giving this outfit a 10 out of 10. What do you guys rate this? Peace. We don't gotta use gloves, okay? I am loving this outfit. This outfit is definitely a 10 out of 10. Um, I purchased this in a size small. I think um, to get into it was a little tough, but that's what latex does, is it snuggles the body tight. I don't even feel bloated, I feel sexy right now. I feel sexy, promiscuous, I feel seductive, I feel just wait until the hair is done, okay? The shoes are really giving. They're super tall, super high, but I love, literally, it matches, it literally matches the dress, like. It's perfect, it's perfect. Snug, it fits me like a glove, baby. <laughs> you like it? If I could give it a 20, I would give it a 20. This is probably my new favorite. No, I don't know. I kind of like the outfit number three a lot too. So I feel like they kind of have its own vibe, but the latex, the latex, baby, the latex. I'm not going to be wearing this underwear because this underwear kind of look like big granny panties, but they're not. They're not. I can't be walking around with these. These are not no walking around shoes. These are shoes where you walk in and you sit in a couch in a section being served liquor left to right. This is not shoes that you wear to walk around with, okay? Got it? Got it. <laughs> But I love how it's like over the over the head here. But my boobies kind of look kind of weird, you know. 
Maybe it's because I'm not used to a bralette like this, but it's super cute. I love the quality of it. Um, I love how you're able to see like a peekaboo of like my tat. Um, yeah, so from head to toe, um, we got the school girl shades. I wanted to pair like the black um, with the whole outfit um, to kind of offset um, all the other colors and kind of bring out the black a little bit. And then I threw on the silver bag with the silver shoes just to match. And then the pants kind of tell it all. I wish the pants were just a little bit more baggier. I had gotten a medium, but I should have probably looked at the reviews to see like, did it, did it run a little bit big or small? Um, I wish they were a little bit bigger. I feel like bigger. I said bigger. Um, I wish they were a little bit bigger. I feel like it would have made me feel a little bit more comfortable because the bitch is still bloated. But you know what I'm saying? We gonna get that working. We gonna get that working in two weeks. You know what I'm saying? We gonna get that working. But I really do feel like if I did probably pair this outfit um, off with maybe a more vibrant color, um, like a lime green or even a red, like with the bag and the shoes, I feel like it'll made it pop a little bit more. Um, since it is camouflage, you can pair anything really with camouflage. Um, but I love these pants. I love how they're stretchy in the back, so they're kind of adjustable. I mean, you could kind of adjust it a little bit. Um, and I don't know, like maybe kind of wear this like one thing up, maybe like a, a thong with like the glitter letters in the back. I don't know, y'all. I don't know. But it's kind of still giving a little bit sophisticated, a little classy, um, but still kind of sexy. Um, and I love that. So what would you guys rate this? Um, I would rate this an eight. I would rate this an eight for sure. But maybe a 10 when I get my hair done. I feel like the bun is probably offsetting it a little bit, but, but I'd probably wear the bag. The pants. doesn't feel as snug as I expected it to fit. Um, but I would probably wear this outfit with like a big, like my bigger necklace. Um, this is like, it says the raw, so you gotta look raw, like, you gotta look raw. <laughs> this is more of a casual outfit. I'd probably wear this with like a black bag, you know what I'm saying? Something cute, casual, you know, something to walk around like the mall in, probably grab some food with, last minute thing. You know, a last minute outfit for sure. Um, but it's very comfortable. I love the quality of the shirt. The shirt is very, very soft. Um, the pants, like I said, I wish they were a little tighter, but um, they do have pockets, um, which I love. Super cute. And the leather is even very, very soft. So this is kind of in relation of the two-piece leather outfit that I showed you guys. I don't know what, what I was thinking when I picked all these black outfits, but black is like the color, like the go-to color to wear. You know what I'm saying? If you still wanna, if you wanna not feel like you, you know what I'm saying? When you walk in, everybody got a statue, wear black. Well, not for me, cause who don't stare anyway. But black is such a great color to wear. Um, But like I said, I probably wear this with like a bigger chain, for sure, like a bigger chain, but. Other than that, that is the um, that is the finale, y'all. So I had told you guys the other outfit. I think the other outfit. I think that was number six. I think this is outfit number seven. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. 
it was very tiring, but I was definitely very excited to put all these outfit ideas together and put, to put them on, to try them on to see how they fit, to see what's coming with me to Miami and what's staying. Cause sun gotta stay. Sun's gotta stay. But I'm always so excited to give you guys fashion inspo ideas. If you guys are not that, um, following my fashion inspo page on Instagram, the link is going to be below. It's LV Fashion Inspos. And I'm always linking up where I get the outfits from, what you guys could expect when it comes to spending. Um, so yeah, tap into that. I definitely want to make 2024 on my page more try on hauls, more outfits that I'm trying out with you guys, more fashion. Um, so go ahead and tap that like button. If you guys are not following, and click that subscribe button. Turn on those post notifications for every single time I post. You guys are the first to see it. But other than that, without further ado, let me know what was your favorite outfit. What fav what stuck out to you guys? What would you guys wear? What wouldn't you guys wear? Um, if you guys want me to do more of these videos and kind of get more into detail, what do you guys want me to say? What are you guys like looking looking for when you guys watch the video? Um, and yeah, I'm happy to give you guys all the deets about these affordable fashion um, infos. And if there is a recommended brand that you guys would want me to do, and not just the Sheen Tron hauls, even though that is my go-to thing, um, let me know. All suggestions are welcome, recommended, um, and we is out. Peace.